Dun, dun, dun. SolidWorks. Welcome to Simple Run. This is uh, my first go at the SolidWorks video on YouTube. Uh, SolidWorks is what I do for my daily job, mostly. Um, test fixtures and stuff like that, so I don't really get to design stuff that I would say I'm passionate about, but it's more of my job. I want to get into designing computers and cars and body kits and stuff like that. Um, but I'm going to take my first go at doing some computer desks and some probably computer cases, custom reservoirs, distro plates, stuff like that. And then eventually when I get a 3D printer, I'll start designing stuff that I can 3D print as well and kind of play with that as well. Um, this is just a jump in, so kind of start off with a template I made for basically the overall dimensions I want for the desk, which is going to be... 6 foot by 8 foot desk, 30 inch deep. I'm going to put the monitor in the corner along with the motherboard right in front of it and the graphics cards off to the side and then custom reservoirs into the long portion. I kind of want to do a triple custom loop. I might put in a secondary computer for storage. We'll see. I do want to make um, hot swappable hard drive set up in there so that when I'm editing or stuff like that I can put my stuff onto hard drives and they fill up you just pop it and swap it. Um, so yeah that's kind of a really quick rundown of it so let's get into the SOLIDWORKS.
So it wasn't extremely long. It was about an hour of solid works on my end. Um, the back corner, you can see the triangle layout spot, and that's where I plan on putting the power supply. And I'm hoping to hide all of my excess wires in there, along with making a sheet metal corner for interface. That way my HDMIs, uh, USBs, all of that hook up right there in the corner, kind of back away from everything, but still easily accessible. Um, I'm still contemplating how and where I want to do the GPUs. Um, one thing I do plan on using is uh, 560 rads, which will use either four or eight 140 millimeter fans. Um, the more fans and the more cooling, I'm hoping that I can keep the RPMs on those low and not have a roaring desk. I want something that's nice, quiet, cool, so that when I start really ramping up the work usage, it doesn't sound like a jet taking off. Um, one thing I do plan on using is an EATX, at the very least an ATX motherboard. Um, I want something more like the Threadripper. Um, I still have this, this run of the 99KS. It's not something that I really need to upgrade anytime soon, so this desk is more of something I want to take the time and really have something that stands out when I'm done. Um, we'll get more into the theme and the details and that as it progresses, but I do want something that's a workstation with the capabilities of gaming. So with that, I'll probably go more aimed at like whatever the Titans are. Um, I know the 3000 series NVIDIA is supposed to be coming out soon. Really looking forward to that. Um, should be a good jump. Again, I've got the 2080 Ti. Don't know that I need to upgrade now, but eventually I will. Um, I love the look of this computer, but I am pretty much maxed out on its capabilities. There are a couple things I can adjust and in the future I'll probably um, redo the cables and stuff like that. I'm gonna have to drain and uh, switch out the liquid here in a couple months anyways so I'll probably do some more work on it. But with it being the Mini ITX, even though those are getting more popular, they're still not really all that full of capabilities. Now it does everything I need right now. So I have no reason to upgrade. However, that will change. And when that does change and I am ready, I want this, di this desk ready as well. So if you look forward to seeing more SolidWorks videos, more uh, custom computer building, uh, hit like and subscribe below. Thank you.